course, everyone wanted to know about your experience working with some of Bollywood's big stars. So what was it like with Karina Kapoor? And I believe you and Deepika are really good friends. So can you tell us a little bit about your experiences with them? Yeah, I, I have actually, um, uh, I think everybody's anxieties, anybody coming from outside the, the film world or any kind of exposure to it, has always always has this anxiety that, you know, it's a world that you uh, will not fit into and people are a certain way. And um, I've had a really touch wood, a very smooth journey of meeting very interesting people, meeting really lovely people. Um, a lot of people... And, and realizing actually that that at the end of the day, they're all normal human beings. They're just in a profession that is just more out there uh, and, uh, you know, under scrutiny. But um, it's not, it doesn't make you as a person any different from, uh, you know, anybody in a corporate world, perhaps, yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so I've, and I myself am a very real person. I find it very difficult to try and be somebody else, even though ironically I'm an actor and that is about becoming somebody else. But um, in reality, in person, like I'm the worst liar. I always get caught if I try to lie. And um, uh, th that whole pretense I can't do. And I've found enough people in the industry who are like that. And I, I share, I've got a lot of acceptance and warmth from people who, uh, you know, who I've looked up to in my life and who seem so inaccessible and far away. Even someone like Deepika, I remember when I saw her in Om Shanti Om, I thought she was so beautiful and, uh, you know, I, I was really inspired by how she she had this certain vibrance and she was so young and she made all the right choices for herself. And then I meet her uh, on Veke Bad and she turns out to be the most, uh, you know, down to earth and, uh, um, you know, um, um, rooted person, um, most normal person I could meet, and um, and similarly for a lot of other people, you know, like uh, even Soha, who I met on uh, uh, Midnight Children, and uh, we got along very well. Uh, uh, Shimi and uh, Shikha Kalsanya, we're all, uh, you know, we, we uh, meet up all the time. I met Imran um, on Vicky Bad, Imran Danish. We're all people who are very much in touch, UD. So there are enough people who have met uh, and, you know, each person, honestly, even a person like Shahrukh or Karina, whenever I meet them or Abhishek, Aishwarya, all these people, I feel a lot of warmth from them. And, you know, I think I I would say this, I suppose, on behalf of everybody in, the, in this business, that people really uh, want to be normal and real. So, you know, in some ways, uh, it's just that there's a certain front, a, a barrier between you and your fans who are watching you with these, uh, you know, um, off awestruck eyes. But at the end of the day, everybody is normal and they want to have normal equations with people. Absolutely. And so tell me, recently, some of the movies that, of course, film fairs, uh, Barfi and Kahani did really well. Any movie that went by recently that you're like, damn, I wish I'd done that movie? Oh, so many. I mean, I, I, I mean, I, I loved. In fact, this year I would say is one of those years where, I mean, or, or rather the last year that went by, uh, has had some fabulous things. And I mean, if this is how uh, it goes, I mean, I, it's really like, for example, I would say this year it was really a tough choice in terms of choosing which is the best film, who's the best actor. I mean, there were so many great performances, great uh, products in terms of you know, the technicalities of it, the, the entire film, uh, you know, the film as a whole. So, um, yeah, I mean, I, I wish I played uh, all, each one of those, you mean, I wish I was in Barfi, I wish I was in Tahani, I wish I was in Ishak Zade, I wish I was um, in Ek Me or Ek Tu, I wish I was uh, um, um, in, in um, uh, Gang Gangs of Vasipur. So, to me, all these films are very exciting and, uh, and you know, my envy is a very positive envy because it makes me feel like if there's such great work happening right now uh, uh, in this year, uh, then that means that it's only going to grow and give opportunities for, uh, for, for, for everyone to, to, be, um, to be able to be a part of something in a, uh, which, is, which is much, you know, which is great quality cinema. 
Absolutely. Well, we're really excited to see Midnight Siren, and we are very excited to see uh, how you do in this film. And we can't wait for you to do a Masala Bollywood film. So a last message to your fans who are listening right now. Well, um, I just that please, um, you know, go watch the film and give your honest feedback and uh, pray that I get all the kind of different roles that I want to do and have something to come back and show to you that you can be proud of. Awesome. Thanks so much for your time, Sarah. Not at all. Thanks, Mom. Hey, take care. Bye.